Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is kind of like a nighttime routine, but it's all about the things that you can do the night before to get you totally prepared and organized for the next morning. So you're not rushing around and forgetting things and your morning routine becomes shorter and a whole lot smoother. So if you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new and let's get started. So the first thing is to pick out the next day's outfit because I know I'm not the only one that when trying to find outfits, it's like 45 minutes of ripping everything out of my wardrobe, umming and ahhing, then having a full mental breakdown going, I have nothing to wear and my life is literally over. And also, by the way, my hair is now blonde. You can go over and check out my Instagram if you would like to see a picture, but that's something that's new. Anyways, back to the whole mental breakdown of wardrobes. Uh, picking outfits is really, really hard and it's so much easier to do it at nighttime rather than wasting all that time in the morning. So just go ahead, check the weather so you're not wearing something too hot or too cold and just piece it together, lay it out and then hang it somewhere in your room. Shoes, accessories, everything included so that it is really easy for you to just grab and put on in the morning. Oh, also, you might notice I also have a tattoo. It's my first ever tattoo and that's new as well. I have so much new stuff, I seriously. So the next thing is to prepare your lunch or your food for the next day. You can either make entirely new food for this or you can go ahead and in this case, just make a whole extra amount of whatever it is that you're having for dinner. So for this night, I had potato and leek soup. I've just got regular potatoes, a leek and some sweet potatoes. And I just went ahead and made my soup like I normally would for my dinner. But then I went ahead and set aside some into a container that I can take with me the next day. Then I went ahead and prepared the rest of my lunch, which I have gone for some super healthy celery sticks and carrot sticks with a whole lot of hummus in a container super healthy and the other thing that I've included as well is fruit make sure you have some fruit and some water because you need to stay hydrated so it's just all about preparing your fruit and your meal the day before so that you don't have to waste the time doing it in the morning So while you're preparing food, if you can and would like to, you can totally prepare your breakfast as well. Here I've just cut up a bunch of fruit and veggies for juicing because I really like to juice in the morning. But if you like to do smoothies or salad bowls or anything like that, you can just go ahead and cut up the stuff the night before just because it saves you all that time in the morning and you don't have to waste it cutting up and doing all that sort of stuff as well. The next thing is to go ahead and clean and just tidy up after you've gone ahead and destroyed the kitchen like I have. So I'm just going to put away the rest of my leftover soup and I'm just going to pack the dishwasher, do the dishes, wipe down the benches, put everything away that needs to be put away because I find that when I have a clean kitchen, it's very easy for me to come out in the morning and just get straight in to doing the things that I need to do. If it's messy, it almost puts me off and demotivates me for the day. So I like to do a little bit of a tidy up before I go to bed. It's kind of like routine and I just... You know, it's like a nice thing to do before you go to bed. And the last thing that can really help you be prepared for the morning is to organize your bag or whatever it is that you have to take with you if you're leaving the house. So like your bag, your notebooks, your diaries, pen. I feel like having a pen at all times, it's kind of crucial, but just organizing and stacking somewhere that is within easy reach. And it's a place you're going to remember to grab all of those things. So all you have to do is just scoop it up and walk out the door in the morning. You don't have to rush around going, oh my gosh, I've got so much stuff to get and kind of lose track and forget things. It just gives you a little bit of extra time in the evening to make sure that you're on top of it and you're super organized. Mm -hmm. 